All right, everybody, this is B.B. Davis. We got up next here the Texas Selections at Round 2 NFL Draft number 2024. Defensive back, Kamari Lasseter, Georgia. So he's headed to the Texans. Texas should feel pretty good about that coming from Georgia. You know what how they do on the on on, on the field. So he's gonna be ready, like ready, ready. All right. So they're about to pan to Kamari Lasseter. Yes, sir. He really has an impressive play. He's quick on his feet. He can either feel good at, I mean, he knows how to get it moving. He knows how to get that coverage. And then, like, boom, he knows how to stop some coverage as well. So that's going to be a really good look there. Uh, he had, like, 34 tackles. Uh, I mean, really, really good. Really good. Athleticism is just great. So, I think that's a really good move there for them. So, hey. Love it, love it. But I'm B.B. Davis. B.B. Love Sports. The Sports and Gaming is Exquisite Fusion. We're locked in right here in Detroit, Michigan for the NFL Draft 2024. This is round two tonight. And I think everybody's feeling really, really good. Um, lots of great picks. We did one through 32 on the first segment so we're in segment two and i thank you so much for being here it's overcast skies in the d but everybody's feeling good fans coming out feeling good everybody's like all lived up you got just so many people doing such a great thing you got the children out there as ushers they got their media tags on it's just wonderful. So what we want you to do is stay locked in, go get your goodies, and come on back because there's lots of football draft talk tonight awaiting these picks and reactions and more. So you know what to do. Stay locked in, everybody. Okay, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. Uh, we're going to see who's on the clock coming up, so we want y'all to stay locked in. All right, we got it. Arizona Cardinals is on the clock right now for their selection. And so we're going to lock it in round two. And here we go. The excitement building. I want to I thank you all for hosting such a wonderful event. Where's all my Cardinal fans at? Cardinal fans, there can be what you call long suffering fans, but here we go with the pick for the 2024 draft, everybody. And they are going to select. All right. Max Melton from Rutgers. So we're going to take a look at him, this cornerback. And we're going to see if we can get them stats. Two-time honorable mention for the Big Ten. 22-23. Oh, and he jumps high and looks up, too. So he's a magic money maker. Money on the field now. Not the literal money, but... Okay, in his career, he had 107 tackles. Some nice breakups in there, interceptions. So he's going to be a real good asset there for the Cardinals. Yes, sir. So round one, he has some good company up in there for the Cardinals. And so with him coming in at round two, you got Darius Robinson and Marvin Harris Jr. for round one. So they're loading up weapons for the Cardinals. Well, like they're saying, you're definitely going to need your defense players, as, uh, definitely, because, you know, when you look at everything, defense do win Super Bowls. All right, we're up next with the next selection. <laughs> The 2024 NFL draft, the Las Vegas Raiders. Hit the Raiders. Jackson Powers Johnson. Raiders on the clock. Raiders are on the clock with Jackson Powers Johnson coming from Oregon. 
and they got him and his family and friends. Everybody is like so excited. And he's just like, this is a sigh of relief. All right, so he's about to go up in Sin City, though. Prayers up for him. Ha <laughs> ha! Going over there to Las Vegas. But yeah, Jackson Powers coming from the big old Oregon. This is going to be sustainability. They're really going to uh, get a good asset there from the Raiders. I do expect the Raiders to make some pretty good noise um, for the upcoming NFL season. You know how I do with my picks. I think you should rock with me through my picks. I think they're going to be making some pretty good noise for the season. We'll just see how far that they go. But yeah, Jackson Powers Johnson from Oregon, okay? And uh, in 2022, he was unanimous All-American. And um, he does have some really good stats that they be putting up as well. So uh, we, we'll see how it goes. We, we'll see how it goes with his rankings and all of that good stuff. Okay? Round one, he has some good company there for the Raiders. So everybody's pretty happy. They're panning to the family. Everybody's feeling good. He's sitting there taking it all in. Uh, it's a really calm crowd right there. So I love it. I love it. So uh, y'all keep it locked. Y'all know what it is. Packers logo came up. The pack pick is there. We got cheese heads. Hey. Y'all know what it is. <laughs> Our team is already loaded. So let's go, baby. Let's see who we got. <laughs> Cause they're booing us. Ain't that crazy? That's crazy. Look at that, hey Ma. Look at that. They're booing. <laughs> Cause they know we are the lethal threat, baby, coming up for the season. All right, Texas A&M. We got linebacker. Okay, we got Edrin Cooper. Cooper is always a good name right there, okay? So, he's coming into the pack. Welcome to the pack. Okay, coming from Texas A&M. He's going to make some nice noise to the addition of threats. We already got Arsenal. And he's quick. And he can see that field too. He can see all the quick plays going. Oh, yes. This is going to be great for uh, the Packers. <laughs> Oh, yes. Welcome to the pack, brother. Welcome to the pack. And all those TFLs were not because he was flitzing. You want to talk about key and diagnosing, getting off the spot, playing downhill? So this is one that we can get behind. Absolutely. So this is a solid pick here. I think everybody should be happy. We're going to go to the boards a little bit later on to see how everybody's feeling. But I feel pretty good about this. I mean, he can read those them plays. This is a nice one for the pack. Go, pack, go. All right, so we're about to go to the boards here after we get some more. Um... Look, it's been just a minute. We're in our own war room. And so far, I mean, a minute ago since we put this up, 1,369 likes for the pack. All right, we're going with another selection. The Panthers are back. <laughs> okay, here are the Panthers. Yeah, feels good to be home. Congratulations to all of the draft picks. Yes. I welcome you to this NFL fraternity. I'm so excited for your future. Um, all the coaches, all the players that I played with, just want to give you all a special shout out and thank you. I know Coach Saban is in the house. You know where my heart is too. The Indianapolis Colts have traded 
the 46th pick to the Carolina Panthers. So that's the war room trade. Indianapolis forfeited. Here's a voice that's been for the Panthers. Who we got? Running back. Texas. Keep pounded. Now, this is an interesting pick here. Jonathan Brooks. Okay, running back to the Texas. They're going to need that speed. We're going to see what he can do. And, um... I think with this class coming in with what had to work with on last season, which was a little disappointing for them, I think we got some great sparks. Not a few sparks, but we got some great sparks and great looks that's going to be coming for the Carolina Panthers here. Okay? Because he's electric and he can get up. We check his highlights because that's what you're supposed to do. Go check the reels. He can get through all that traffic and get down to them first downs. He's quick with it, and he knows how to run, too. I mean, he he don't have no, let me build up speed. He's moving it, and he gets it into the end zone really good. So this is going to be pretty good at electric with uh, the Panthers. They just had Xavier Leggett wide receiver round one, and then you got this running back, Jonathan Brooks, round two. Oh, they're, they're building. They're building, and they're building nicely. Very nice. So, definitely need to watch out for the Panthers to see what kind of sparks they're going to do, too. Building a nice young team here with some solid guys that's doing their thing. Okay, so G-Men is going to be up next. I know I got a couple of good, good goodies who are G-Men fans, so we'll see what happens with them. So what we want y'all to do is stay locked in. Everybody, we'll be coming back. It's round two. Draft night, TGIF. So keep it locked with me, B.B. Davis from B.B. Love Sports. Sports and gaming is exquisite fusion.